there anything in here? No. See, it's kind of nice because I'm slowly getting, like, having memory. Fuck! Come back. Yeah, there's a dog. Yeah. Dagger. Boom! Excellent. Fuck you, pupper. Aim down, aim down. Okay, no, it's dead. I'm fine. And Fuck you, you, dog. And you still have four daggers. Now, um, this is going to be leading to the, um... The defiler of the accursed coffin, huh? I wonder what that could be. Yeah, right. Huh. Um, a water-based puzzle. Okay. With snakes. I like water puzzle. I like snakes. I don't like snakes. It's locked. I think that's where that leads to. It's locked and oh. I don't have any goddamn keys. Hello, Cupid. Oh, wait. What? Examine the dog whistle. Well, yeah, because that's a thing that, um... Because you'll get more details. By blowing it, it generates frequencies only audible to the ears of dogs. You can call dogs with the whistle. So, you need to call dogs somewhere. So, what is your current location titled? Uh, my or... current location titled is... There. <laughs> is that flashing room right there. It was second floor. The guy okay. said. Okay, it's so a terrace it's, right it's there. that down yeah. there, yeah. Cause I, think I was that... thinking that's the room where it was, I think, but... I think the dog has the helmet key. Yeah. That would be a useful key to have. It would be. Oh, fuck, God damn it! <laughs> yeah, you were too far into the button mash to be able to... stab him in the face. I'm good at button mashing, though. Yeah, well, I mean, if you press... If you do the reactionary trigger instead, it actually just stabs him in the fucking head. I, I mean, I get that, but I'm good at button mashing, though. Fair enough. Oh... Well, wait. Yeah. Until the color is red, do not use the mix herbs. Okay, so that's the bathroom. That's down that way. No, I actually think, because isn't this the thing that goes out to where the dog it was running around? Beyond the fence, but this isn't the second floor. Yeah. Yeah, because this is where... So there's a bunch of herbs out here, so I'm going to use an herb. Good call. Not a bad idea. Because I can go get a green out here. Now, while you're out here, do you want to get the chemicals? Oh shit, you used the green one. Oh, god damn it! God damn it, pupper, go away! Okay, you might want to end up using Yeah, you need to use it. And, um, shotgun and aim down. <laughs> uh, yeah, he's dead. So yeah, just go ahead and work out here before, you little shit. Right? So yeah, I'd take that while you're at it now. Um, after you get to the next thing where you save or whatever, you might want to go out to the graveyard. Okay. And get the extra rounds just to have them, because... Well, I might be going back right into the... Oh, yeah, but I need to use an... Uh, no, I actually do have a uh, room. Yeah, because you, you're going to want to have those, and if nothing else, at least reload it and keep it loaded. Yeah. Because the shotgun's ammo capacity? Six. Okay. You know how many how many you get in a clip? When you um, get the um, six or twelve. Okay. Cause I was gonna say. Um, oh, there you go. See. Boom! Nice shot. It's not dead. Oh yeah, it is. I think yeah, it's dead. Blood. Yeah, I didn't see. And it shot a point blank with a shotgun. I think it's dead. Yeah. So get the other pistol rounds there. Cause you you passed on them before. Oh yeah. Where's the other way? I think. Oh no, that way worked. Never mind. I'm thinking the other side. No, because I was thinking, so the efficient way to do the shotgun would be to use a clip, then get ammo. So then you're using the least amount of memory space. This is true, um, but at the same time, if you need it, that's a bit, I don't know. But yeah, this was the trade-off. Yeah, it was LT. I think it's hard to use Oh, God. Not dead. Now it's dead. When you hear the squeal... I didn't make a goddamn monkey sound. Yeah, when you hear the um, the monkey squeal, it's dead. Um, but that was the thing that confused a lot of people at first, because everyone thought that, uh, oh, we got cheated out of that awesome scene. No, they just moved the scene. Yeah, they moved it so it would still be freaky. Yeah, so it would still confuse everybody, which is really cool. So, yeah. So, I did the shotgun thing I wanted to do, because I'm out of shotgun ammo now. Yeah, you unintentionally did it, but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, I killed those dogs, though. Damn straight. The shitty dogs. There's an item in there. Yeah. Don't worry, you'll get it. 
that's I think actually the the map to the bottom floor. Oh okay. So I can well now I can go get the shotgun because I'm right here. Mm -hmm. Barry. Oh. Oh, Jill. Hey, Barry. Got any good news? Go? And that's the Other scene. I'm still alive if you trigger this madhouse? scene first, no. Yeah. Then you have to have the broken shotgun either. to get the regular shotgun. Secure our escape route first. There's gotta be a back door. Can you somewhere. get the broken shotgun and then go back? All right then. Let's split up again. Hey, hold yeah. on. Yes. Well, because you can put Look the thing yeah. back. What? But yeah, you can always pick up the, the broken shotgun yes. at any point. It just becomes it's useless sure at that point. Mellow those um, things. Now, it's yours. Hopefully, you won't have to use it. Oh, jeez. He's giving you some. Yeah, grenade launcher rounds. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Um, they're acid rounds. Those are useful against you? hunters. Yeah. Oh, don't worry. I like um, the buddy system we have here. <laughs> so, I just have to talk about how monumentally stupid. Now, look at that. It's hollow point. It. Yeah. He's firing a hollow point. Ciao. How stupid of a fucking idea it is to constantly split up. Yeah. Like, in this scenario, like, these zombies would be trivialized even if you didn't have weapons and you just had two people. Yeah. It's like, oh no, I'm being attacked by a zombie. Like, Barry, punch it in the back of the head and get it off me. Yeah, right. Now, um, a hint and note for you that's going to be very useful. Well, fuck, now I have too much stuff to get the shotgun ammo. Right. Uh, this is a very useful hint. While we're playing this, when Barry says something... Yeah. Pay attention. Yeah. Listen to him. <laughs> okay. Like, if he says something to do something, do it. So I think I'm gonna go to the item box. Right yes. There. Good call. The through the incomplete room or through upstairs. Through up here. Okay. The interconnected warp hole that is the <laughs> uh, the item boxes. Because I need um, healing. It's true. Items. I don't want to go fight a dog. And I need to dump some stuff. I don't want to go fight dogs. If I don't have any healing items or any shotgun ammo. Yeah, because the shotgun... Oh, God, fuck you! Good call. Nice. Cool, run past him. Or go wherever you need to go. See, you took zero damage from that yeah. because it was before he bit you. So that was the excellent timing, dude. Oh, wait, you have kerosene and lighter. Burn the body. This one right here? No, there's, no, there's yeah, one down the one. hall. While you're here, you need to burn every body that's down, because it is super important, because it's based on the number of times you go through the room. Okay. So be very slow here, though, because you might be able to see him. Okay, no. He's on the other side I can of just that. fuck off from him, because he's facing that yeah, way. Yeah, but um, be, be prepared to also um, move away from the body, because they will catch fire, and yeah. they will actually hurt you. So when you light it, you have a few moments to back up. Burn it. Holy shit. Yeah. Because that is going to get... So, do I have uh, to... Use the kerosene. Just a second. I am leaving... Out... The door okay. So, just be... Just back up as soon as you do it, too. Fuck! Let's go through the door, go through the door. Okay, so that's probably the trick one. They probably lure you. For yeah. That. So if you want to shotgun him, later. Yeah. If I want to shotgun him, I need shotgun ammo. Yeah. Um. So you're in the item box room, though, right? No, it's not. No, you're not. Item box room is through there. Oh, shit. Okay. Fuck. Um. Because I've never done that. I've always had him get up and chase me down before. Yeah. So that was probably a, a um, scripted event for that. So shit. It's probably like, hey, are you going to try to burn the Crimson Head before you know what a Crimson Head is and you're supposed to? No, fuck you. Because that's the training one, probably. Yeah. So, neat. Oh, so, no, it's right there. Oh, no. It's oh, yeah, but mm. see how I get down there? I have to go uh, the wrong way. Shit. Well, then. Good luck. <laughs> um, The other one's on the fucking other side of the house. So, uh, I'm going to go... And, of course... I don't ink ribbon, so I can't say right now. Yeah, um, see, see where this becomes scary. I do have dog knives, though. Anti dog knives. <laughs> Anti dog knives. Uh, there's a tape, I think, on the counter. I already got it. Unless there's another tape. Oh, no, I'm thinking of something else. Because he's holding a tape. Okay. And right. I already got that. I thought there was something on the counter. My bad. This 
So did you ever kill that one? <laughs> did you just keep running past it in the no, hallway? No, I just keep running past it because okay. it's a pretty easy one to run past. Yeah. Okay, so where to fucking go now? It's annoying you can't discard items. Right. Do you have any room? No, you no, don't. No, I don't. But I wonder if um yeah, I have to pick it up and then reload or if it'll go straight in the Or if it'll let you reload it. Yeah. I don't think it will. But yeah, I can't carry anymore. Hey, look, I have grenade launcher rounds. I don't have a grenade launcher. Yeah. God damn it, Barry. Why did you give me these fucking grenade rounds? You hope, messed it all up. I hope you won't need to use this. Well, good for you. I won't be able to use it. Pretty much. I'm pretty sure there were herbs in the dog room, though. Yeah. Two green herbs. So, yeah. So, I'll be good to at least heal going in there. How can you pick anything up? That's fucking true. Yeah, this is fun, isn't it? <laughs> so yeah, the only options are to... Go and deposit stuff. That's the option. What about... No, wait, I'm fucking stupid. Yeah, that's the second God one. God damn it, we're fucking idiots. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. Uh... It's like, put it like this. I would feel bad if it was just me. I still feel bad that it's both of us. And I feel worse that it's both of us. Because we have two people working to fail at the same thing. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> no, man, maybe we could use the actual door that gets in. Oh, well, yeah, maybe we can just yell out. Home. Yeah. <sighs> and there's the Zizzlezorp. Oh, uh, to the right, right there. Just aim down. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't expect that to happen. <laughs> <coughs> Will this guy go crimson head? Eventually? Uh, yeah. Should I burn him? Yes. Uh, rephrase that. Save. I'm gonna save and then I'm gonna burn him. Because <laughs> if he turns into a crimson head after I burn him, no. This is a good episode. <laughs> I'm having fun, are you? Yep. <laughs> uh, yeah, so, uh, deposit the, um, that. Yep. No, you so, want, you want the doggo whistle. You're doing better than I was, because I have burned through a lot of ammunition, and, um,. But I have also burned a lot of bodies. But at the same time, you have um, brain busted two of them, whereas I have done that to zero in my playthrough. So that being said, I'm more coherent um, than. <laughs> Assuming you don't crash your entire computer desk into the ground. Yeah, my computer desk is taller than I am technically, and oh boy, um, bumping that thing, you hear a bunch of tumbles. Um, it's a scare. It's scary. Um, because every time I was playing it, it was super, super late in the evening. Yeah. <laughs> this is, like, three in the afternoon. Yeah. I'm far more cognitively aware. <laughs> Hush, you. <laughs> okay, do you have a Oh, goddammit, I need to go back in there. Yeah. Well, who cares? Just try and burn it now. Awesome. I hope that shows up on audio. <laughs> so just try and... Ah. You, can, you can cut that out. No. <laughs> Just, you should have burned him. You should have tried to burn him. I'm gonna laugh. I forgot to fix my, I forgot to mess with my items. I'm gonna laugh so hard if he gets up. Like when you walk through that door. Because that's gonna be a big slap in the face. So is the knife actually useful for anything? No. <laughs> the knife is like a joke. So blue gemstone. Blah, 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 blah. So I have everything I need. Yeah, it's always good to leave at least one open item slot because yeah. you never know what puzzle item you may encounter that you may actually need right then. Yeah. So it helps prevent backtracking. Which this game was designed around you to backtrack. Okay. So yeah, he is not actually tinted red, so he should be burnable. You'll still need to take a step back, I think, though.
Yeah, you're too far away. There you go. So yeah, I'm just back up. There you go. Yeah, no, you're fine. He's gone. He's a, actually a burnt corpse now. The model changed a bit. Um, so, let's see. Where does this take me? So it takes me to... Oh, Oak there's door. a... Oh, that's an open... It's a finished room. Okay, so yeah, nowhere. You're good there. So, does a finished room... Will it finish if there are still any items in there? Um... So, like, say this room no. has an herb in there that I didn't pick up the first time? Uh, you need to have actually picked up the item. Okay. There's still a guy upstairs. Yeah. That's what you're hearing. Because, yeah, you uh, brain brain popped that dude, which was fucking sweet camera angle for too, by the way. <laughs> um, and um, then you burn the guy downstairs. So you've got... Uh, that's two for three. <laughs> okay, so now I'm going to go deal with the dogs. All right. Um, uh, uh, shotgun ammo. Shotgun ammo first, then dogs? Yes. Okay. Uh, just to have it, because then you can reload it, and then you can continue yeah. from there. It's kind of cool playing this, too, because um, my memory is slowly coming back. Yeah. I didn't, like, I think I got to Lisa Trevor. Yeah. And I think that's where I ended up stopping, because I have memories of my encounter with stuff and thinking I should be dead at this thing, but I wasn't <laughs> dead where I thought I would be. So, um, I think that's actually where I ended up stopping. Um, the original time I played it. <laughs> No, there's. I really like the mentality that um, that, like this game is promoting, where it's you have to kind of make these little runs outside of the safe area, to where it's like, okay, so this time out of the safe area, this is all my supplies, and I'm gonna do this, this, and this, and by that time, I have to come back to the safe room and save again, and dump all my items. Yeah, it's kind of like this is where the modern survival game started, legitimately. Like if you look at things like Ark Survival Evolved or any persistent online game, um, like even Minecraft, like. You have to give credit here, because Mikami had some really cool ideas he implemented with this stuff. How many shells did you get? I think six. Six? Okay, yeah, so... So yeah, my plan My plan was the correct plan. You're golden. Alright, so next time, we're going to, um... Fight doggos. <laughs>